Wonder who the Alms of Light and Darkness will be? They're coming by boat, so I guess we can leave as soon as they arrive. Better make sure we're prepared, just in case. What's Hina up to at the palace? We haven't spent this long apart since we left Tianiya. She might be lonely by herself in a strange new place. That settles it. I'll go check on her. Ich bin ganz allein. <lacht> Wer da wohl einsam ist? So Hina and the others are in the palace. The Alms probably have real fancy rooms at the palace. Ich möchte endlich mal den Palast äh, aufräumen. Maybe I can still try the front entrance. Aufräumen, ja, Whatever. so nennt sich das. Und Nico möchte ich besuchen. Komm rein da. Ich will wissen, was es mit den Münzen auf sich hat. Oh, Spielverleber, du. Wir machen doch nur einen kleinen Abstecher. Die weiß ja nicht, dass wir sie besuchen. Also fünf Minuten länger warten macht keinen Unterschied. Wir fenstern. Angeber. Her room's gotta be around here, right? There's someone there. Hmm. What's Val up to, I wonder? Heya. I figured you might be lonely, so I wanted to check and make sure everything's okay. Oh, you thought I was the lonely one? But you weren't lonely at all, right? N no, of course not. In fact, I was busy making plans for the trip. Ah, yes, the picture of Soul Guard preparedness. That's right. <laughs> Joking aside, I realized I'm more weak-willed than I thought. Hina? If I'm being completely honest, I'm... scared. Scared of what? Completing my duty as the Alm and sacrificing my soul. It's terrifying. When we set out on this journey, I hadn't really thought about the consequences of becoming the Alm. Of what I'd really be giving up. I never questioned my role before. It's ingrained in our traditions, after all. Our purpose in this world has always been to continue our way of life. The Yalms are how we protect the future. But now, after traveling to all these exotic locations and meeting so many different people, both good and bad, I realized... Never mind. I'm probably overthinking it. Ow! Oh! <laughs> What's up? Orin! Sorry for eavesdropping. Can I ask? If you two could be together forever, would you continue living your lives as you are now? Until you both grow old and gray. If you never want to let each other go, I can make that happen. I can show you a future free of the alms sacrifice. If you trust me, come to the pier by the market before sunrise. I'll be waiting. Do you think 
a future without sacrifices is possible? But what'll happen to us and our mission? I want to hear what Orin has to say. Hina? Okay. Let's go talk to Orin. Do you remember when we were kids, and I got hopelessly lost just outside Trunk. of the village? Oh, yeah. Once I noticed you were gone, I ran out to search for you. When I found you, you were crying, which made me cry. I know you must have been scared. We left without telling anybody. Do you think we should have included the rest of the group in this? There are alms, too. True, but it's already late, and I know that Karina, for one, was exploring the palace from top to bottom. I bet she's fast asleep by now. Also, I get the feeling that everyone else has already come to terms with their role as alms. But I... I just can't. I don't want to have to give all of this up. I want to keep living my life. And now that I've realized that... I know that what I really want is to stay here and keep making memories with you, Val. It's silly, but I don't want the others to see how selfish I've become. How unworthy I am to be an Alm. Don't say that! You were personally chosen by an elemental spirit. You'll make a fantastic Alm of Fire. Thanks, Val. That does actually make me feel better. You're not the only selfish one. I wish I could keep traveling with you forever. Not to the mana tree, just anywhere. And everywhere. But I don't know how much stock we can put in Orin's plan. If there's no other choice, I think it's our duty to see this pilgrimage through. Agreed. I accepted the title, and I will do what needs to be done. But I'd like to know our options first. You know... You're a pretty good soul guard, Val. I was scared to talk about so, how I was come scared. So, can we I thought maybe the others, or even you, Val, might be disappointed in me. Hina, nothing you say would ever make me think less of you. And I know the rest of the convoy feels the same. They'd listen to what you have to say. You're right. I'll talk to everyone when we get back. But first, we gotta hear Orin out. Es geht noch nach unten? Da war ich noch nicht. Da gibt's noch Loot. Yes. The fuck? This is kind of exciting. Nice. Zwei Bonbons, ja. Wie bitte? 31? Wo kommen die her? Ich dachte, wir hätten nur neun oder so. Good. You're willing to take a chance on me. We want to hear you out at least. What is it that you plan to do? How can you make it so that alms aren't needed? Won't the world fall to ruin if the alms don't sacrifice their souls to the mana tree and replenish the depleted mana power? It won't. I'm going to change the unjust laws of fate that rule this world of ours. I can fix it all. And the world will be better for it. For people like Hina... ...and Liza. Liza? You mean, like, Liza Liza? <laughs> it figures you'd know her. She was a soul guard from Tiania like you. After she completed her mission, we settled down together. She's the love of my life. Oh, we heard she got married, but didn't know who her partner was. 
Is she okay? Where is she? She's around. Still in Guju, actually. Four years ago, she... Uh, well, she was named the Alm of Earth. Liza became an Alm? But didn't disaster befall Guju? Just because the village was destroyed doesn't mean everyone was lost. But living on the edge of a knife, waiting for fate to strike you down, is no life at all. I need your help to change this world for good. So, why ask the two of us? Any alm would be fine, but I don't know. When I look at you two, I see a lot of me and Liza in you. That's why I want... no. Need you both to help me. What do you say? Want to change the world? <laughs> I want to see the future that Val and I can make together. Sounds like I'm at your service, Orin. I knew I could count on the pair of you. Hop aboard and let me show you what I found. Did something happen to Liza and Guchu? These days, she... She has a hard time moving. And it seems that she still considered the alm of our village, even after all these years. But I just can't let her go to the mana tree. Where are you taking us? A small island with a place called Rainus Shrine, where we can perform the ritual. What ritual? It's a ritual that allows another person to borrow the life energy of an alm. That sounds dangerous. Will this ritual hurt Hina in any way? Everything will work out. Using the power of a person chosen by the elementals, I can make it so the alms won't have to sacrifice themselves, just like in the past. Oh, you mentioned something about that on the prim. Is that why you're traveling the world right now? Yep, I've been searching everywhere for a way to fix things. I'd be willing to do just about anything as long as it's for Liza. And that's how I happened upon the two of you. What's that? That is Rainus Shrine. It was built back in the time of Fadiel to honor the elementals and give thanks to the spirits. The elemental spirits are more in tune with things like this altar, so it's a good place to perform this ritual. I'm gonna head straight for the altar, and get things set up. The terrain is a bit tricky here, so watch your step. <laughs> 